Not interested in the price of stock. Not really, no. Yeah, me either. Lousy weather. Yep. Yeah, sure is lousy, all right. Thirsty? A little bit. I'll get you one if you like. I was on my way to the canyon anyway. I'll bring one back for you. Coke or lemonade? Those lands, I thought they might make close that 15, but who's got 14 and away 14, 13, 12, and who's got 10 then? Bit of a looker, isn't he? It's an attractive sheep guy, I guess he's up there. He's a Ridgeway Pole Merino stud. 21 micron, soft, rolling skin, comfort factor, 100. Mustn't forget that comfort factor, you're making so much as royalty. What a load of crock. You are a dead set tosser. It's all done on gut reaction. Check the legs, make sure they're nice and firm. Balls, make sure they're even, full. In that order? No, oh, yeah. You don't want them to get the wrong idea. How does he know who's bidding? Nod of the head, wink of the eye. Yes! My God, who'd buy that sad looking bunch? They're half dead. Yeah, you'd have to be desperate. <laughs> Yeah, right. Forget Ruffy's. Forget Ruffy's. That's right. They've been on a hunger strike. 14 80, you've got 14 80, you've got 14 80, you've got 14 80. Anybody else? I've got 15 dollars. I have 15 dollars. I have 15 dollars. I sell them. Uh, 15 dollars to Tamakaya. Thank you. That's half my cash is wasted. So, what are you doing on your days off? I haven't had one yet. <laughs> no, you wouldn't, would you? Stupid question. I hear you like to ride. Very funny. No, look, I didn't mean it like that. I just... Look, I like to go for a ride down the river sometimes, you know, on a Sunday Arvo. It's, it's magical. It's not like a day like today, but I was just wondering, you know, if you could sort it out with Claire and, you know, you, you can spare the time. You know, maybe we could sort of spend the day. You know, I might move to the city anyway. There must be cheap places to live. At. No, I reckon I'd find somewhere to crash, no problem. Yeah. Park bench or a stormwater drain? Well, maybe. Hey, I'd be the youngest, best-looking bag lady in history. I'd be eating out of garbage bins, but at least I'd have my personal stylist certificate. It'd almost be worth it, don't you reckon? Don't be like that. I'm trying to find a way out here. You said it yourself. There's nowhere to go. I have to go. Claire doesn't like me and Mum thinks I'm a total loser. Do you really think that? And if I stay here, I'm going to go crazy chasing dumb, stupid chooks and moron cows and all those sheep. <laughs> Who wants to live with 5,000 sheep? You do. And Claire is my boss. It's like having two mothers for crying out loud and all this work to do. It's like they're doing me a favour. Jody, shut up. Take a look around. You say a couple of the right things to Claire and you're set. You got a job, you got a home, you got a family around you. Have you any idea how important that is? Oh, sorry, Beck. You're still upset for me. No! I'm happy as a pig in mud, Joe. I know when my luck's changed. to get up and shove it into gear. I'll do it. It's not a good idea. Why don't you think I can? Look, I've been climbing windmills since I was seven. Claire, please, let me tell you something. Number one, you're a pain in the bum. And number two, actually, I think number one just about covers it. Be careful. Oh, what do you know? She cares.
she all right? Doesn't look like it. Okay, now we're going to go down, one step at a time, all right? I can't! Yes, you can. I'm not going to let go of you, I promise. Now just stick your right foot down, straight down. Hey! Oh, I've got you, I've got you. Sorry, you okay? Okay, look, I'm going to place your foot down with my hand, okay? Okay, I've got your right foot. Just give me your foot. Okay, we're just going down a bit. A bit further. A bit further. There you go. Good. Okay, I'll do the same with your left. That's good. Good. Okay, next one. You've got to put your foot up just onto a little ledge. That's good. See, it's not really Everest.